Good morning, everybody. It is morning. I'm wearing a sweater because it's cold out. Too cold for the summer beer. But it's sunny, so that's a good thing. I don't know why, but the hardest thing to do is to sit down and film an intro to a video. I don't know why, it's just hard to sit down and do it, and it's hard to put my thoughts together in a coherent manner because I don't plan anything out, I just ramble. And that's why it sounds like rambling. This is my third cup of tea this morning because I slipped and I went back to drinking coffee for one canister of coffee. <laughs> that wasn't a big canister, it was a small one of this really good kind of coffee that they serve at my favorite coffee place. And you can buy the stuff. So I bought one and I was drinking it every morning. And sure enough, I started feeling worse and worse and worse. First couple days were great. I had lots of energy. I think that's why I started because I hadn't slept well and I, it was a beautiful day and I wanted to get a lot done. I thought, oh, I need some energy. So I drank a cup of coffee and just like that, I was the energizer buddy. And then of course I had another one and the next day I had more and the next day I had more. And before you know it, I was hooked on it again. But now I have gone cold turkey. This is my second day. And it's taking me three cups of tea just to try to get close to normal. Close to normal. Wouldn't that be nice? The world is not normal right now. Nothing in the world seems normal. 2020 is going to go down as the strangest year. I just hope it doesn't get worse. It's been bad enough. You have been wanting me to do music and my agent has been pressing me to <laughs> do music. Um, and I've kind of been doing everything else, but, so that's why, I, oh, that's Rocky crawling under my desk. What's that about, huh? So that's why I thought, okay, I'll start recording and I'll, uh, I'll teach myself how to use GarageBand again. And I have a little mic set up, so that's why I've started making these records, not records. So I've started making these recordings and they're not perfect by any means, um, because I, I still can't figure out how to get enough volume without distorting. I'm still working on that. Anyway, I have now done a few of them and I just finished another one. Just bumped the camera. The last one I put out, as you know, was very serious and sad. So I thought, okay, let me just do something a lot more lighthearted and not so serious. Even though some of the lyric content in here is, I think, kind of fitting for this day and age. But you all know the song. And I hope you like it. I hope you like my take on it. I was just having fun. Found a guitar track online and then I... Just added a whole bunch of my background vocals on there, which is my favorite part of recording anyway. I love that. I just go. Okay, quit, you guys. <laughs> they have one toy and they're fighting over it. Hey, get it. Okay. Anyway, I recorded the song and put on background vocals, and then I also played the synth strings on there. And I don't know how to play, very well, piano at all, but I've been... But I spent a lot of time to try to get it to sound halfway decent because I really wanted some strings. Billy would do all this for me, but he's very busy because he can do his work remotely and Billy is a very busy Billy. <laughs> he's a very, very busy musician. He's very much in demand for programming and all that. So uh, he has been helping me out though. Uh, the ones that tend to sound a little better are the ones that I send to him and then he mixes them so they sound a little better quality. I don't think I want to do that with this one. This is short and this fun, so like I said, it ain't perfect, but I hope you like it. And I just took some more footage of life around my house because you guys seem to want some of that stuff with the horses, so here it is. I hope you like it. <laughs> Big hotel, a boutique, and a swinging house back. Don't it always seem to go that you don't know what you got till it's gone? They pay paradise, put up a parking lot. They took all the trees, put them in a tree museum, and they charge all the people a dollar and a half just to see them. Don't it always seem to go that you don't know what you got to explore? They pay paradise, put up a parking lot. 
Hey there farmer, put away the DDT now Give me spots on my apples, but leave me the birds and the bees Please, don't it always seem to go That you don't know what you've got till it's gone They pay paradise, put up a parking lot Late last night, I heard the screen door slam And a big yellow tractor took, took away my house, took away my land Don't it always seem to go, that you don't know what you got till it's gone They pay paradise, put up a parking lot They pay paradise for the parking lot. They pay paradise for the parking lot. Oh yeah, they pay paradise for the parking lot. Damn. Okay, so now you watched it and you got to the end and you saw the snow. Could you believe it? For those of you who live in my area or around the Northeast, snow. On May 9th, it was shocking, but we were lucky we only got a few inches. Uh, north of me, they got like a foot. That's crazy. It's just crazy what's going on. Nothing is normal anymore. Can we please go back to something that approaches that? Mm -hmm.